Good morning, Washington Street friends. I'm happy to see you today. Today I want to talk to you about a parable. A parable is a story about something or someone where we're supposed to listen to the story and see ourselves in the story. So today I'm going to tell you a story about a tree. Now this tree was very little and very young and it looked up into the sky and saw the stars and it became unhappy because it didn't have any stars. Well God saw that the tree was unhappy and so God gave the tree a beautiful mantle of leaves and God thought surely that tree would be happy. But the tree was not happy, and the tree said to God, I'm not happy. I want stars, like the stars in the sky. And so God gave the tree some beautiful apples. And these apples were so pretty. They had many different colors, and they were sweet to taste and lovely to look at. But the tree was not happy. Well, the wind saw that the tree was not happy and that the tree did not like the apples and the leaves. So it tried to blow and shake all the apples and the leaves off of the tree so that the tree could be happy again. But only a few apples fell. But one of the apples that fell broke open. And it broke in half. And when the tree looked down, it saw something very special on the inside. Look, a star. Well, we're supposed to learn something from this parable. And it's that God gives each one of us special gifts and talents to use for God's purposes in this world. We all want special gifts, and sometimes we see that those gifts belong to other people, and we want those. But that's not always what God has planned for us. So we try to give God instructions on what we want, and we forget to trust God with the gifts that God has given us. We need to remember that each one of us has special gifts, and when we use those for God's purposes, we shine like stars. Let us pray. God, Help us to find the gifts that you have given us, to use them for your purpose so that we can do your good work in this world and shine like stars for your glory. Help us to rejoice in those gifts. Amen.